Sup, folks? Main man, lucky last remark. Mm. Boros Burn. That's right. We guys are excited for it. I know I am, at least for the time being. Like I said, my name's Lance. Of course, more importantly, my screen name is Major Riot. That's Major underscore Riot underscore. That is my screen name on Twitch, YouTube, MD Joe, MGA, and Twitter. If you watch this live on Twitch, please are following. Watch this on YouTube, please are subscribing to this video. A thumbs up. You can also follow me on Twitter for reasons unknown. That's right. Follow Major Riot on Twitch and Twitter. And if you're subscribed to Major Riot on YouTube for the low cost of free, don't delay. Do it now for a guaranteed outburst of rage, confusion, and even sometimes joy. I always have a disclaimer, though, just in case. I am not responsible for your sudden increase in optic only lands, being wrecked by Ragavan, or being unable to find your sideboard cards. If that starts happening to you, it has nothing to do with me. So I'll put that out there right now. Um, but as you can tell, I do enjoy playing Magic the Gathering. All I watch my videos, you may never know that. And when I do play Magic, I used to always say I prefer Modern. I really play whatever the RCQ season is. I qualified early this season, so I don't have to play a bunch of Standard for you, the viewers. Uh, I am still playing on my phone, even though today I did not because um, I had to get an update. Like, I didn't need an update when I left the house, and I go to go play during my break and lunch, and there it is, need an update, and I can't update without Wi-Fi. Um, so that sucked. Um, but, uh, yeah, we're going to play some Boros Burn, and it's actually one of my favorite decks to play just kind of casually, even though it's really good, in my opinion, a lot of times. Uh, I'm not going to be here the rest of the week. I have way too much stuff I got to do. But I am here today to play more Boros Burn. Uh, 50 Sentiment's also here today, and he says, Salute the Major with the Guile Family Man emoji. Yeah, salute. They haven't changed Guile to Street Fighter 6 Guile, where he's got a goatee. Um, take a look at the weather, and like I said, guys, every day is the same. I wake up to snow, and then I come home from work, the snow is gone. Uh, weather for Ravendale Gunners are fair with a temperature of 39 degrees. The wind is blowing from the northwest at 7 miles per hour. And the current humidity is 58%, so there you go. Weather for your friend, Major Riot. And let's see here. We're still 54 followers on Twitter. We're still 346 followers on Twitch. We're still 597 subscribers on YouTube. So shout out to all 54 followers on Twitter. Shout out to all 346 followers on Twitch. Shout out to all 597 subscribers on YouTube. And of course, a massive shout out to all eight of my Twitch subscribers. Give me a little bit of the harder money. It's very trying and dangerous times. I really appreciate it. Go way above me on the Call of Duty, obviously. Spend that money anywhere else. Make a lot more sense than here. And, uh, you know, I, I appreciate anybody who watches this whether live on twitch or record on youtube i've always got to have a particularly massively robust adult style shout out for those that will contribute financially it's insane really it is um that five bucks on the twitch subscription that could be going towards a soren imperious blood lord right now uh, i'm just saying uh but yeah we're gonna play some more uh boros burn it's the same list i had yesterday Tunnel Ignis is questionable. I played against two Amulet Titans right off the bat, and this didn't do really hardly anything. Um, Eidolon was good. Not going to lie. Eidolon was pretty decent. Again, you know, the card's just proven good. I don't know why it ever came out of the list to begin with, but I don't know. Maybe it was Merc Titan. That doesn't make sense either. Um, anyways, look going in there. I really got nothing else to say other than the fact that uh, apparently you're just never going to be able to play... Uh, I don't know how people are getting Vein Rippers. On uh, MTGO, I have not seen one available to purchase um, at all through Card Hoarder. Like, you can get them in paper, but you can't get them on... <laughs> like, I don't get it. Like, what the hell? Alrighty, well, before I uh, do anything here, I need to reveal my beverage today. And folks, it's a good one. I'm not sure I've ever even drank this out of a can before. I'm talking about a 12 ounce can of Mountain Dew Major Melon. Look at that. We got some Major Melon here. Um, it's pretty good. You know, it's actually the best new flavor they've come up with maybe ever. And, uh, you know, I'm really, I'm really down with it. Uh, we all know the official start of the video is we get to my crack my bear is going to happen right now. Here we go. Oh, man. There we are. That's some good stuff. And uh, thank you, Vinny Sentiment, for the sugary beverage sip redemption. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, I'm going to keep. I mean, it's not the best pan. It's all right. Could be better. Um, Any other card sellers have? What are the other card sellers? I know I, I just, I've been going card hoarder literally for like over a decade. So I'm a little distrusting of anything else. You know? 
Oh, great. Merfolk. Well, at least the Searing Blaze might be good. Leave up Bolt. Now if it says like slivers, be like, oh my god. Slivers. Bolcha. Oosh. Another different steering blaze. That's excellent. This is where Searing Blood be good. Exquisite Firecraft might be good too. Yeah, I'm going to wait till their turn. They may have that new card to stop my uh, my fetch here. Yeah, here we go. Oh, yes. Why would they not have this card, right? How amazing. Well, at least I got it out now. Maybe I still have two more lands to play with two steering blades in hand. Other different lands. All right, just gotta do it now. All right, that's dead. I could really use like a lava spike. For sure. Yeah. That is now an island. What the fuck is going on here? Are you fucking kidding me? This motherfucker had two of these and this? Okay. It's a long road ahead. But, I mean, you don't have the fastest clock right now. Unless he finds Lord of Atlantis. Wow, that's another different land. Uh, I just got to play this tapped. <laughs> right? It's, I'm so fucking slow now. I mean, this is going to be at least 8 damage. I, I can't really survive this. Yeah, because even if I kill 1... Right, because i got to have double red. So I bring in a land, double red. If I find Lightning Bolt, it might be okay. Maybe. I'm just so slow here. Now they have Ward 1. Well, that doesn't really matter. Yeah, getting lit up. I mean, look at this fucking start. I mean, they just turned all my shit into fucking islands. You know, I can't win now. This is how it goes whenever I play the fucking game. Whenever I play the goddamn game, I get absolutely fucked up.
What what doesn't suck? What doesn't suck? Putting a bullet through my fucking head? How about that? That doesn't suck. That fucking blows out. Just the hands that I have to deal with sometimes are insane. They're just insane. Like, there is no way I could predict that that was going to happen. There's just none. Uh, probably Path of Exile is the only one here that really matters. Is Eidolon any good here? I don't think Eidolon's that good. I don't want to bring in Smash Smith Rings just for... They have four copies of Aether Vial. It just doesn't really seem to be that important. I never brought, I always side and pillage out against humans. I bet your merfolk sucks too, huh, Gage? What deck doesn't fucking suck? Just all you do is play the top tier? Like, that's, that's it? Like, even those decks probably suck ass. I know guys that play fucking Crash and Footfalls and shit, and they bitch all the time about that deck. Like, yeah, I went to go cast my, uh, what is it, Crash and Footfalls off Cascade. Opponent had Force Negation. Deck sucks. Like, yeah, it does. Fuck you. You know? That's what you gotta do. Um. Yeah, I... Guess this is fine. Just start with a rift bolt. There's a lot of burn damage for just not being creatures. I mean, 16? Damn. What's up, Alias? It's going pretty good. Playing Affinity. I just heard somebody talking about Affinity. I was at my locals, not locals, but a card place I go to to trade in cards. You know, I get like 20, 40 bucks a week doing that. And um, how much did I get this week? $43 this week. And um, he was talking about he wants, he plays Affinity and he really, really wants damn old... Uh, Oh my god. Really wants uh I guess just suspend it too. Really wants Mox Opal back. I could not remember it. Which I'm like, that's never coming back, dude. Never. Him to Turok? Are you crazy? Why would you be okay with him to Turok? No, dude, that card's never coming out of Vintage Legacy. Ever. No. Never. Ever. I've played against him to Turok. It's one of the least fun things ever. Like, that is so... Well, I guess, yeah, because you play the rack. I mean, that makes sense. Well, there you go. <laughs> that makes sense then. But, dude, that's that's insanely busted. Really enjoy this. This should still work. It's still a three mana. All right, well, shit. All right. Um, anyway, get rid of that Chalice of the Void. But he's cut off of his own... He's cut off of his own Aether Vials. That works. Uh... Yeah, exactly, Gage. No way. First off, people always like, they say dumb things where they go, they go, uh, why? He just got, <laughs> nice. He got burned for two and just got fucked. Oh, it can't be counter. I think like Cavern Souls. Duh, yeah, Cavern Souls is here. Uh, sure. I mean, again, I'm just going to get wrecked by this thing. I'm completely locked out of the game. Well, I guess I swing at him. I guess I'm not completely... I mean, I'm going to swing at him. 
he takes it, he's down to... Did I swing at him? No. No, I'm not going to swing at him. No. He's probably got another different Tide Binder, right? Uh, but people will say, like, oh, we already got the Grief Scam, so who cares about him to Turok? It's real fun when they discard your lands, right? <laughs> like, it's at random, so it feels even, like, worse. Like, you shuffle your hand, put the cards out, and they're like, you know, however they pick it, which I always make them roll a dice. And, uh, yes! Yeah, all right, locked out of the game. Love it. Absolutely enjoy it. Here we go. How? How can this guy have this many against me? But anyways, I mean, he can't really cast much. I mean, that's fine. Getting tilted after burning inquiry? Oh, yeah. I mean, that that's always annoying. Losing your cards at random is always really tough. All right, I mean, this guy's basically have to beat me down with his 2-2 here. Maybe he's got force negation here. I don't know. Rather have them take two ram cards and include lands than my best two non-lands. No, dude, no, no. That's not how that works. Because if you have lands, there's hope that you can play them and eventually top deck into something. But when you have your lands stripped away, you literally cannot play the game anymore. Like, you actually cannot play. And, um, I mean, I've, I've done both. I have cast him to Turok, and I've been blasted by him to Turok. And it is, like, just a devastating thing. When you, you, when you discard two lands from the opponent, dude, what the fuck is going on here? How can these guys have such incredible hands all the time? What the fuck? What do you exile? Trickster? I think I was going to lose. I, I, I do not think I can win now. Like, he can't really cast anything either. I mean, he's just kind of locked, too. So, I don't know what's going to happen here. But, sure is exciting. I'm probably just going to take beatings from this guy. Just swinging for two every turn. I mean, I can't even block. I should have swung for two the first time, right? And maybe he would have traded. I don't know if he would have. But... Regardless, I don't know what he can really do here. I mean, he's just be taking two. Okay, I mean that's bad. But he's at two, so he can't. He cannot cast the rest of the game. He can't block these anymore. They have islands. So I guess this game's just over. <laughs> the game's done. I I can't win. Nah, I guess I could. He has to block, and that would make this at four. I have one more turn. I I can't survive because I have to get white mana to cast this. I, I guess... I mean, I have to attack. I mean, I can't not attack. Uh, pretty unlikely I can win here. But, yeah, I got to swing for two. He probably just has... He probably just has another different Master of the Pearl Trident, right? I assume that's what's going on. Even though I don't know why he'd be so slow to cast it. If he had this first one. Uh, but uh, here we go. Yeah, Rift Bolt, Skewer the Critics would work, but something tells me he's got some for this. Fantastic. Fantastic. Dude. I don't know how it's possible to lose to, like, being basically Blood Mooned, where I can't play anything. I mean, I literally couldn't do anything. Have you ever seen Burn players stuck that fucking bad? Like, it's just crazy. That guy had the fucking nuts both games. 
for, particularly for Byrne. Like, I think against Jund, he would have massively lost. I mean, I don't think he could have possibly beat me if I was playing Jund, right? I, I don't think so. I mean, like, Fatal Push, you know, Tarmogoyf to block, and it was just, you know, it was just like, what the hell, man? This, some people, the problem with Boros Burn, I've always found, is people are so extremely prepared and hateful for it. Like, it's been a good deck for the entire existence of Modern, so everybody and their fucking mom, and even their fucking mom's dog, knows how to play against it, knows exactly what to do at all times. You know, there's never any questions of anything, ever. They're just like, oh, I just gained, like, four life and I win the game? Like, yeah, pretty much. I, I gotta mold this. I can't keep one lance on the first attempt. Not much better. Uh, keep and put a skewer on the bottom. Ah. Ah. Yeah, it's gotta be skewer on the bottom. What am I doing? And, uh, start off with the old Rift Bolt. Rift Bolt's one of the few cards where I like both artworks for it. I prefer the original, but I do like the second one as well. And then, uh, really been struggling to cast. I haven't cast a creature yet. No, I cast an Eilon. Oh, good. Urza. I mean, this is nice and slow. Even though, though I'm sure they'll have a uh, turn three, uh, what is it? Um, Worm Coil. Uh,. Yeah, I mean, I'll just uh, thin down the deck right now. Seems good. Boosh. I did everything I could possibly do. I didn't, I tell you one thing I didn't do, I didn't rant and cry and cuss enough. I probably should have done that. What the hell? Why is this in the main deck? What's going on? This guy was acting like he had like force negation. I was gonna be super, super confused. Yeah, it must be Etron, right? When's the last time I played as Etron? For real? I mean, it's been so damn long since I'm playing as Etron. Oh, thank God I'm drawing these. But, I mean, still, goddamn. <laughs> that gaze redeemed blow a kiss? Sure, pal. There you go, buddy. What cheek do you want it on? And I mean cheek on your face, not on your ass. All right, well, let's just start blasting them. There you go. Some more damage for you, I hope. What's the counter spell they got? I guess they got nothing. All right. Okay. Not sure how good this is, but we'll throw it down. Well, again, it's another deck where I think that if you knew what you were doing, it'd be like like me and Gruel Panza. Like most people, it is like a guaranteed. What the fuck? It's fucking Blue Tron. Uh, put it on bottom. Ah, uh, maybe I should put that on top. Whoops. But, um, yeah, I probably should put that on top. I don't know. I'm not sure. What's crazy is they haven't gotten an island if they're Blue Tron. There we go. Now they're unbeatable. Now I cannot win. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Dude, guys, I have no idea. Man, it's going to be close. I think I just got to blast him like right now that he's tapped out. Do you think he's got another? Subtlety can't hit Lightning Helix, right?
I don't think so. Fuck it, let's go. Oh my god! Dude! Yeah, I mean, I mean, I, I don't know what to say. Like, I mean, they had force and every... I guess I should have waited till their turn. But my thinking was they most likely were holding up. I mean, they haven't cast one counter spell yet. That What's the one they use? The one here? Yeah, Repeal. I figured he must have had another one because he used Repeal a, 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 as an exile cost. So that's like their best counter spell by far. And I just got absolutely hosed. I mean, I can't win now. I'm just going to concede. They're going to minus 10 that thing. So yeah, just concede. I mean, what the fuck? What the fuck? It's just crazy. Uh, Searing Blaze has got to go. Like, that is so bad here. Smash the smithereens. We can only hope we'll do something. Um, I guess fucking wear tear. Uh, anything else? Maybe one Eidolon? Yeah, Eidolon seems okay a little bit. I don't know. Eh, we'll take one. Oh my god. Look at that. I, I may have a chance now as I'm starting with creature. Uh, yeah. I always like starting with Goblin Guard. I like swinging for two. The uh, Remand. This fair. Swing for three. A minimo. All right, they're at eleven. They, what is happening there? Why would they not, they must have force negation or something. Why would they not play this? What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Sure. I don't know what happened there. Pona apparently played the wrong land. Sheer confusion. Sheer anger. All right, do it again. You're fine. A little bit slower, so I'm going second. Uh, yeah. Swing for two. There's his power plant. Well, that's all right. They're going to have another power plant for now. They just suspend two Rift Bolts, I think. I think I'm pretty pleased with that. Uh, first, I'm going to swing, though. Lorian Revealed.
probably uh teferi hero of not hero uh time raveler coming right to just destroy my rift bolts mm, he's trying the original impulse had different wording i think i think it actually said like shuffle instead of put it at the bottom pretty sure Oh. Boom. Oh. Uh, I'm going to swing for two. Oh no. All right. Uh let's go idle on. Oh wait, no. I want to do uh do lava spike first. Well, I guess I should have done Eidolon. Get rid of Lorien. See that Ugin? Oh, even better. All right, just time to concede. It's time to concede. All right, I mean, there's just no point. I mean, I guess I could try. I guess I have one shot here trying to find... Um, uh, smash the smithereens or something, which I doubt will even work. No. Oh. Because of, um, sure, now there's going to hold up counter spell the entire time. So, yeah. Probably just dead here. Now that Smash Smithereen is really going to do a lot. They have another life linker when this comes out and it dies. Just horrible, man. Well, I don't want to bolt my own dude. That that's stupid. I'm just gonna see if I can't top deck. Hey, uh, what the hell is this? The one ring? What the fuck is this? Wow. I'm just conceding. I want to play. I want to play this guy. All right. I only won a game because he fucked up. I mean, he played the wrong land somehow. So, you know, another miserable day of playing Magic the Gathering. Another day where you just hate yourself at all times. Where you're just like, man. I could have smashed my hand with a hammer today and been more exciting than this. Just another day of hating life. Because of Magic the Gathering. Everything else, great. But Magic the Gathering is... Fuck, it sucks. You know, you're stressed out about what cards you're going to play. You know, a guy told me he has four Vein Rippers in paper for me. And I'm like, dude, I don't know if I want to play them. And he's like, come on, man. You know, and... and uh you know, he's like, I need the cash. And I'm like, well, I kind of do too. You know, these are expensive and all that jazz. And I can't even practice with the deck on MTGO. I'd have to play on like an arena. I really don't want to play it on arena. So it's just like, you know, just so much stress with this game. It, it's not fun. Like, I haven't had fun 
like straight up real fun with magic hardly at all in my life. It's always just been like really negative. Like really negative. And I'll keep. Uh, oh, delighted halfling. Great. So this is probably Yogmoth. I mean, do you normally just bolt this still as burn, or do you bolt player? I don't know. I have no idea. I mean, what's their one card that gains life? Uh, uh, Blood Artist. I, I think you want to play Eidolon. I mean, yeah, he could just minus, but that's relatively okay. And he just makes a, another one. I think we just want to just stay here like this, right? I want to put on another idol on because he does nothing, right? I mean, his plan must be to. I'm not really sure how to play this at all. I've actually never even seen this before. What you're supposed to do. Yeah, I don't have a clue. See, I'm glad I didn't play that other, uh, that idol on. Go to 10, back up to 13. That's six. I mean, he casts one spell with his Eilon on the field, he just loses. Just gonna do blood artist. Oh my god, fucking gilded goose. I didn't even think about that. So I can't win now. It's over. Two creatures in there. I can just make a food with that. I need like I seriously need um uh like searing blaze here. Me at eight, I'm at five. Skewer the critics. Well, I guess I can draw here I 
mean, I guess I should probably Lightning Helix that, as terrible as that is. Fuck. Walk one. Puts me at five. Mountain. Go to five, back up to eight, back down to five. Got four creatures in there. I cannot win because he can just ultimate this. Fuck, that's really close. If he just didn't have this one, I'd win. Uh, yeah, I lose. All right, another fine loss. Motherfucker didn't even do anything. That's what sucks ass. Because he didn't do a damn fucking thing. Like, what? Oh, my God, dude. Four and one? I mean... I guess we just swing at him just because, right? Just... Right at player. Yeah. And I knew. Just concede. Fucking terrible, man. Absolutely horrible. I think I need to bring in Smash the Smithereens just for, um,. Just for the, I don't know. I, I, I maybe I shouldn't cite anything. I mean, Eidolon seems extremely bad here. It did nothing there, so I guess smash the smithereens, which probably isn't going to do a lot. I mean, I could try Roiling Vortex instead. Maybe that's better. I don't know. <laughs> I get yeah, Roiling Vortex seems okay actually. Uh, yeah, sure. I mean, this hand looks pretty good. But how many times have I said that? All right, let's get that basic mountain. Put them at 13. Put them down to 10. There you go. Well, this is somewhat okay. I mean, I can blast that with the Searing Blaze. Uh, man.
Yeah, we'll have to do it this way. Swing at him. Goes for the block. Gonna go for the sacred foundry. Uh, go for kill that thing. I'm at four. And um hope I can draw a land. He plays a creature or something. Uh all right, just swing here for one, I guess. Sure. All right, there we go. That wasn't too bad. Boom, boom. I always forget that Rolling Vortex has that ability to um, uh, to stop life gain. Sure. That yeah, might be bad against um what should we call it? That's pretty good though. Put it out. Eh, maybe I should have suspended Rift Bolt. I don't know. Tough. Well, I think I'm going to kill that. I think. I mean, should I cut off mana? Oh, man. I think I just want to kill this thing, right? I think so. Gotta hope I keep finding Searing Blazes. Yeah, see, I'm glad I killed that. They had to land anyways. Oh my god, a fucking Scavenging Ooze? Wow. Alright. Not dead yet. Because I can just blast it with Skewer the Critics. Uh, I mean, that's kind of shitty, but that's what I'm gonna do. Shout out to Scavenging Ooze, though. Horrific art, though. Oh. Can't win. Uh, I'd like to stop drawing motherfucking lands, if that would be okay with the deck. Like, just asking, you know, for a friend.
All right, so I guess I'm not attacking anymore. Funny, I remember Gage, you being all mad, still playing scavenging ooze. You're like, you shouldn't play that card. Now it's your boy. I don't think it matters anymore to kill this because it says any this card says creature control plus one to have all active abilities of creatures exiled Agatha so it doesn't make any sense to kill that delighted halfling so they probably just put a plus one plus one on it on anything right I, I mean I'm gonna guess that's how it's gonna go so I'm just gonna do this Hope they can't find any way to put creatures in graveyard. Oh, Lord. I swing. I could probably just swing here. I mean, they can block. Maybe I don't want to. Because if I somehow kill that, right? Three. What if I killed this? Uh, hmm. Jesus. I think I just cowardly sit back. I don't want to get more stuff in the graveyard for him. Is this goose? Like, I don't know what to do here. I mean, they just get Goose. Now they can exile with Cauldron. I don't think it's possible for me to win, right? I, it's just not possible anymore. Like, because if I kill this, they just immediately exile the, with, the, with this. Then these can all tap to make it. I don't think there's a way for me to win this game anymore. I don't know. I don't know, okay? I don't know. Like, I don't think that makes any sense to kill this thing. They're already gonna gain three life. I, I don't really see a reason to do anything at all. Just hurry up and kill me, fucker. Just come on. So tired of losing with burn and not because I'm not, because they're beating me. It's because they find lifelink. Fucking terrible. Like, it's just absolutely atrocious. Oh, Lord, love it. I I can't win. Just concede. I can't beat Gilded Goose. I can't beat Gilded Goose. Like, I just, I can't beat Gilded Goose. <laughs> they have every card there to beat me. The guy never established anything 
what Yawgmoth's supposed to do. I just lose to Gilded Goose. Both games I lost to Gilded Goose. Period. No. Got them all. Uh, I guess keep and put the steering blaze on bottom. Well, in that case, it wasn't just Burr, I mean, Gilded Goose, it was they had Agatha, the cauldron. Like, um, and here I just lost anyways. I mean, it is, it's, I mean, I guess I can kill, I guess I can hit that with the Rift Bolt. I guess that's all right. Do I even care about killing the Rift Bolt? Should I just blast him? I'm gonna hit him. I don't give a fuck. Especially since I just top deck that. Is that nine? Yeah, now he's just not going to attack. All right. Mm. That's attack with Bolt. I mean, I know he's got not dead after all, but, you know, I mean, one of these will get through. Thought C, sure. Didn't like that Thought C's. Is like Grixis. It's just a mirror. Get the Merktide in there. All right, there's a land for him. That's six. A couple bolts will do here, deck. A couple bolts. That's all we need. A couple of them. Probably gonna be like skewer the critics off the top. No, Merktide. It wouldn't be that big. It'd be like a 5 5. All right, just need uh, some more action off the top here. That's kind of action. All right, let's take a look at this counter spell. Wow. All right, let's see what he's got. Nice. There we go. Well, we just lose there. Block, block. <laughs> Even a fatal push on top. Damn, dude. If I would have just had a lightning bolt there, I think I would have won. Yep. All right. 
Jesus Christ. Um, what else is there to play against this? I really don't have anything. Uh, I really don't. Um, I guess just Roiling Vortex can come in, I guess. Maybe Path to Exile. Maybe Path to Exile is all right. Um, and take out a couple of these. And uh, call it good. I have no idea. This is Demir's Scam? I don't know. I think everything else is fine against the, the guy's deck. I mean, I, I really just don't understand the sideboard burn anymore. No. No. All right. Put the uh, redundant lava spike on the bottom, I guess. This out of the way, grab that, play this, swing for one. All right. Eidolon. Wow. Okay. I mean, I guess it hits every creature in my deck. One top, one bottom. So it's Demir Scam Shadow. Got it. I don't know why he would put the shadow in the graveyard when I'm burned. I don't know. A little bit interesting. Yeah. Um he's probably got like well this has to come in tapped. Um I guess we just path to exile that. Probably got another one, I guess. I don't know. At nine. Okay. All right, I mean, we're just going to try and kill this guy on, on his turn, you know? I mean, just every single one of his turns, just go ahead and blast him.
of course. I just lose here, right? Uh, yeah, I'm just dead. Yeah, because if I go to 11, put him down to 2, it's just, yeah, it's just over. The only hope I have is if I kill this, go to 11, takes me down to 3. No, it still doesn't work. So I would need another land. All right, well, that's another loss there. Okay, uh, time to go for an 0 and 5 here. I need to go on the burn discord and tell them they're all stupid fucks. No, I'm just joking about that. I'm the stupid fuck because I make their deck look so bad. Like, these guys that play this Boros burn deck, they're like hella good with it. I don't get it. Like, like I know it's a lot tougher than it is, right? I mean, you look at it and you're like, oh, that's simple. Then you play and you're like, this is way tougher than what it looks like. But I don't know how these guys are so good with this deck. Like, I just... There are guys that are just insanely good with this deck, and I've seen them in paper be this good with it. And I don't know. I have no idea. I just know I'm glad to be getting the fuck out of here, and I'm not going to be playing Magic for a solid week almost, because, you know, I just, I, I need to get out of here again. You know? I mean, the worst thing I do with my life is play Magic the Gathering. I mean, every day I play Magic, every day that I play Magic, literally feels like I'm just wasting my life. You know, but then I, what else do I do with it? That's always my conundrum. What else do I do with my free time that I, I, I mean, I need my, I need my alone time. I need to not be around people. I need to be able to do something. You know, what am I going to do? Play video games? That's so fucking boring playing video games. I can't stand it sometimes. I played like an hour of Doom last week and I was just like, yeah, this is great. Video games. You know, people are like, why don't you get into reading? Magic the Gathering is reading, you know, and uh, I don't know. I mean, I've tried other hobbies. Like, I tried video games for quite a while. Because One, because I was poor, and I got to pour, like, a game. You know, you can play, like, Call of Duty all the time, and it's, like, basically free once you buy the game. Um, but I just, I, I didn't like it. I didn't like playing video games. It's just fucking terrible, man. It's just so depressing. You know? Like, what a pathetic fucking excuse for a man I am. Uh, Mole. I want to try for something better. That is not any better. One more time. One more time. Another time. Going down to four with Boros Burn. All right. Um... Uh... I guess I'll put skewer, searing, and fiery island on bottom. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. Immediate life link card. With hammer. Oh, it's sort of the me. I, I don't even think it matters, right? Because they just make a guy and put that on there. I mean, what what am I what am I even doing here? Like, just kill this? I, I guess you... Uh... Yeah, this is, like, free here, right? So you kill this. I don't even think it matters. I mean, you put that on there. I have no idea what you're supposed to do. I guess you just blast them. Get a land. Play this. 
I have no idea. Nothing makes any sense in this deck. Like, why does everything have so much lifelink? That's the problem I, when I played this last time. It's just like everything had lifelink. Why? Why did that just happen? Oh my god, dude. That was a searing blaze. I've been pretty stoked. What is this? Oh. All right. Hmm. I probably shouldn't have done that. I probably should have left that. It didn't matter. <laughs> it didn't matter at all. Wow. Just exceptional wows, right? Mold of four, only top deck lands so far, right? Is that right? No, I think I top deck a lava spike or something. Dude, I don't know. Like, how the hell am I supposed to win with the cards I get? Right? I mean, for real. I mean, what is this? Nine cards out of deck, six of nine are lands. How does that happen? Six of nine. I don't even know what to say here. I mean, that's seven of ten. Yeah, I guess they just negate this whole thing, right? Because they go, well, they can tap one more. So they basically negate it. Man, I, I don't know. Like, I think this was a really poorly designed deck. Not, not like, not like itself, like, like the whole thing. I just think that Originally, when I played it not that long ago, there was no Eidolons in it because we had Broiling Vortex. Not that it would matter because I'm not drawing anything, period. But I think Roiling Vortex is much better than Eidolon. Like, Eidolon is just super bad. Like, people just play around it now somehow because everything's for free. Like, people don't actually cast cards hardly anymore. Um, and, um, you know, I mean, what else can I tell you? Like, I can't win. I mean, it's just every turn that goes by. I mean, now he's got... I mean, he can still gain... Shoot. Dude, this is so many lands. Like, that's incredible. Oh, my God. 13 cards out of deck. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Am I counting this right? Nine of 13 cards are lands. I think I'm counting that right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of 13 cards are lands. I, uh, dude. How? Like, I, I, I don't know. I have no idea. I don't have the foggiest notion. Rolling Vortex isn't even good against that. That one, because it's like they just, in response to you trying to get Rolling Vortex, they just gain life, right? I mean, what, what, how do you defeat this? Like, I guess you just need to have a smash of smithereens. And what's funny is when I watch, when I looked at people's deck list, they didn't even have smash of smithereens in the side. Like, I just left it in because I like the card. I should be dead. Yeah, I am dead. Right, because they just do one, two. Uh, it's two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Uh, oh, yeah, they just put that on there. All right, let's concede. Had a mold of four, then it really only drew lands. Incredible. Absolutely stunning. Um, Yeah, smash the smithereens in. Wear tear in. Um, probably just take out something like that. I mean, I like the Eidolon. I like the Steering Blaze. I don't think Roiling Vortex is going to do a lot. Because they just, in response to you trying to pay the one red, they still gain, like, three life. And make all their guys. Like, Roiling Vortex is normally pretty good against life gain. Like, straight up, it's good against life gain. But in this situation against Thopter Foundry, it can't be good. Because it's instant speed life gain. So, I mean, multiple instances of instant speed life gain. Not even like that's a weather the storm they're trying to, like if they play weather the storm and then you roiling vortex, pay the red, and they weather the storm again, at least you're negating one weather the storm for that's a lot of that's a lot of health they're getting back too. But um but yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know. Like, th no, God, Jesus Christ, man. Dude, I don't understand what's wrong with this deck. I, I really don't. I don't get it at all. I can't figure this out. Like, I, I cannot, I, I don't know. I'm giving up. I'm giving up. I, I don't get it. I don't have a clue. Just keep this bottom the second idol on, I guess. I don't know. I'm so distraught over how bad this deck performed. Like, it shouldn't be this bad, like, just on a mulligan front, let alone a top deck land front. I mean, that was, what, 13? Thir 9 of 13, 10 of 14, something like that? I don't know. I mean, this will be two zero and 5s in less than a week. Two zero and 5s in less than a week that I'll be having. You know, how, what's my record for 0-5s in a week period? I think three was the most I ever had in a week period. I think I had two back-to-back -back one time. Um, Just horrible. Like I said, a lot of people would have shot themselves. They would have hung themselves. You know, just this is not how you're supposed to play Magic. It's just constantly losing. with No matter what you play. I mean, it's just crazy. The only deck I have success with is Golgari, Midrange, and Standard. And I don't really want to be playing that on, you know, I want to be playing that off of this because it gets something else to play. I um, guess just to spend there. Uh, swing for two. One ring, sure. I mean, whatever. But, I mean, for real. I mean, what, what can you even say about this stuff? It's just, it's such, it, it's so bad trying to play. I don't have any fun. I constantly feel like I'm being just fucked with. 
Talisman of Progress? Sure. I guess we have one ring next turn. I better, uh... They're gonna fluster storm. Wow, sure. Well, that makes me feel a little bit better. Put them at seven. Then I guess I play the one ring. I play idle on. Oh. When did they have a new artwork for One Ring? When did that show up? Remember that guy had the weird One Ring? I didn't even know what it was. It doesn't even look like something from Lord of the Rings. Like, what happened? I'll probably just play Urza here. All right, I just need a land here to start blasting these things. That sure would be neat. I guess I'll wait to that during their turn. I was like, what is this? Like, I don't remember Talisman of Progress looking like this. Boosh. Would they get a stone forge? They can't even play it. Can I just I Oh it does say I didn't realize it was for any car. I thought it was just for artifacts. Uh yeah. Do it again. Oh, uh, yeah, it looks fine. Got the smash of smithereens, so that's cool. Sure. Don't mind me. Coming through.
This is probably a um, one ring. Mm, pretty close. I mean, now would be the time to uh, to kill that. Uh, so they can go. They only make one mana, right? They can only do one. Probably sacrifice this, gain one life. I guess it could sacrifice itself, right? Yeah. So I guess I, I in the end that kind of worked. I mean, yeah, I missed out on three damage. They gained life, but I don't have to worry about, you know, I'm gaining a ton. I would have waited till their turn. They would have. You know, there's a lot of mana they could do. I mean, I guess they have to sacrifice. Well, they don't have the the sword, right? So maybe it didn't matter. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. There's an Eidolon. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. Probably should have waited. Is this the only good card from Dragon Maze? Like, Dragon Maze is like one of the worst sets ever, right? From what I remember. Oh. Uh, how do I want to do this? Like, this is obnoxious. Sure. Huh, I wonder why they let that die. That's weird. Must be something. All right, they draw a card. Yep.
Target Eidolon. Oh, how do we want to do this? Like, do I kill the one that has idle on? Or do I wait for this to resolve? Because they have much mana they have. They have three mana. So they can gain three life before I destroy this. With the, nah. I think I just want to... I think I just want to uh, destroy the one with the idle on, right? I don't know. Like, I, I really don't know. Maybe that's wrong. Because this is gaining life, right? Yeah, I probably did that wrong. But they, it, I still couldn't be able to attack. Ugh, terrible. Yeah, I think I lost. I think I'm going to scoop. I think I need to kill that. I don't know. Not entirely sure. Oh, it's really disappointing in this deck, just this day and everything, right? Just man. What a really bad day. Just feel like I couldn't do anything. I didn't know what I was doing. I was completely lost, like just feeling miserable. I mean the only thing that's good here is you don't have Sword of the Meek, right? I want to hold that. Well, I should probably draw a card now. That way I know if I get a land, I don't get a land. I guess then I just, oh, I should play it now. Yeah. The thing is, is that he to cast anything, he basically has unless it's a uh, Urza, he, he's got to take damage off this. Wow. Well, there it is. That's the end of the game. I can't believe he top decked that. How many do they run? They run four, probably. So I should have killed this. Right, instead of Eidolon, I mean, uh, instead of freeing Eidolon, right? Because now he just has infinite. Well, he's got five mana, so yeah, it's just over. All right, well. What can I do? Hit six, I guess. I mean, he's going to gain up to 12, and I can't attack him anymore. I'm just going to scoop. I don't care. All right, guys. It's an 0-5. Um, really bad gameplay today. Really, really, really bad gameplay today. The deck was bad. I was bad. A whole life is bad. But, yeah, I plan on being back at 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Pacific time on uh, March, Monday the 11th.
and uh, I don't know I'm playing, but I'll play something. And uh, everybody, be safe out there. Eat some good food, drink some good beverage, spend time with your loved ones. A lot more important playing this. Um, yeah. So yeah, everybody, be safe out there, and I'll see you some other time. Peace.